He used to come to Fisher's all the time. And one time I was in the back talking with David of something, and both of them at the same time said, John, ask John. And they asked me if I'd like to be involved. And I kind of said, in what? And they basically told me a little bit about it. And right away I said, you know, that's the, that's the place I'd be interested in, in, in getting involved in because I have four kids. My son loves college professional baseball and football. And really, there wasn't a, a place where you can go, have a pizza, a soda or a beer, and be able to sit and watch a game. And I, you know, once we started talking about it, I said, you know, that's a perfect place that I'd like to get involved in. We don't have a place like that in Meriden. People like choice. I mean, think about it. When you want to go grab a bite to eat, you're not 100% sure, what do you gravitate towards? You gravitate towards an area of either town um, or uh, even at the mall. You go to the food court, there's more than one choice there. It's not about trying to fight for the same 200 customers that are down here. What it's more about is making it a destination. To me, this is like the cheers of, of, of Meriden. Every time I've been here, from you know working in here to our opening day, we, you always know somebody. There's always someone you can sit down and BS with, um, chat a little, you know, downtown sports, or about the restaurant. So it's, it's just fun coming down here, always knowing you're going to know somebody here. Friends of the Library is a group that tries to make money for the library and tries to help out the library in any way we can. We pay for a lot of the special programs put on at the library, like the children's uh, summer reading programs. Uh, we did uh, pay for books for babies, uh, several other things, and we also uh, contribute to the capital fund at the library. Uh, and when we moved here from the old bookstore at Colony Street, um, one Colony Street, we were there for six years, and, um, we, and it reached a point where we couldn't afford the rent. The rent was so much that we weren't giving any money back to the library because all of our profits go back to the library. And um, so we moved here. Uh, it took us seven weeks to move from the old place into this new, new quarters. And we think that we will get better, it's a better place actually because we're in the middle, middle of the block, we're right practically across from the court, so we'll get jurors in who want to get a book, just, they're going to sit around all day, they can come and grab a book and, and uh, have that to keep themselves occupied. And, and we're really feeling that uh, we'll, we'll have a lot better business here, just walk-in business.